surveillance software that lets users spy on other people is called stalkerware. Stalkerware is a kind of unethical software, a malware, I should say, that records data being entered into a device and sends it to a third party. Stalkerware as well as spyware have similar malicious functions. Stalkerware acts without your consent that it's harvesting your information. It enables stealing images, text messages, locations, eavesdropping on phone calls. So the design of each stalkerware changes depending on what it is designed to track. Stalkerware can also intercept app communications made through known messengers. Most of the time it is simply installed onto the device physically, thus giving the app all the permissions it needs. Remember of protecting your device physically. Parents looking for a way to monitor their child, possessive partners trying to whatever, business owners keeping an eye on their stuff while work hours, they all are the users of stalkerware. In most cases the device owners know it. They know it's made on positive intent or just for safety. But there are other cases. There are also remote options which do not need physical access. These versions will use the same tactics of cyber criminals, a link or email attachment. What if a person becomes a victim of it? If it's not aware of a stalkerware installed, if you ever find yourself the recipient of odd or unusual social media messages or emails, this may be a sign and you should delete them without clicking on any links. Stalkerware won't show up on your app list if you hunt for it, but it is silently working in the background ground, tracking all of your data. If you want to ensure your device is clean on stalkerware, take the popular measures running a malware scan, password change, two-factor authentication, or perform a factory reset and clean install on the device. Make sure you remember to back up important information first. On Android platforms, this is usually found under Settings, General Management, Reset, Factory Data Reset. On iOS, go to Settings, General Reset. Please, don't be too much suspicious. Just take it into account and enjoy life. Take care.